Just a quick tutorial about how to add the magnetic snaps to your 241 tote. Um, what we have here is we're using Sally Tomato magnetic snaps. So we have a front and a back, two washers, two three by three inch squares of interfacing. You can use whatever scraps you have left over from doing your bag. Two squares that are about two by two. And we have our two lining pieces. These are the main center panels of your bag. Um, then I have a marking utensil and some sharp scissors. So to do our first magnetic snap, we're gonna measure down on the front of your lining piece. Measure down about an inch and a half. And make a little dot. So it's make sure you're in the center, coming down. And then you're gonna take one of your washers here and put the lines on the sides. So we're gonna center it on that dot. And we're just gonna make two little lines on the side, we're gonna color in the holes of that washer. So now we'll just have two, two little lines here that's gonna mark where the prongs on the back of our uh, magnetic snaps are gonna go through. So take one of your smaller pieces of interfacing and we're gonna iron that on the back right behind where we're gonna make that cut. So I just have a little square of interfacing on the back of my fabric, but I can still see my marks on the front. So I'm gonna take some sharp scissors or um, even just a seam ripper, and we're gonna just do a teeny little snip or cut right over the marks that we drew from the washer. Better to be smaller than too big. All right, so now I have two holes. And it doesn't matter which one you use first. I'm just gonna pick one of these and take the prongs and push it through the holes through my layer of lining and my layer of interfacing on the back. And then you can open those out and just, it's real easy to just push them down flat. Actually, before we push them down flat, we are gonna put the washer on. All right, yeah, before you bend your prongs down, you want to put the washer on. So you're prongs are going to go straight up through the holes that you use to mark your um, marks on the front. So you want, so you have those bent down, it'll look like this on the front, this on the back, and we're going to take your other um, larger square, one of your larger squares, but be side down, so feel your sides, one is rougher than the other, and we're going to cover up this so it doesn't interfere with anything. So put that on top. Give it a good iron. And you're done with one half of your magnetic clasp. So you'll take your other side, the one with the opposite, um, this one is indented. This one has a little knob on it. So take your other half and your other two pieces of interfacing, one larger, one smaller, and you're gonna do the same thing, inch and a half down on your other piece of your liner. And then this will help your bag clasp together on the inside.